oh yes baby Godzilla's back so let's get to it Ghidorah, the three-headed monster, or in Japanese, some fucking line I can't pronounce, which was going to be the title of this video, but since I can't even fucking pronounce it, I don't think you guys would either, and you probably wouldn't click the video, because you probably wouldn't even know what the hell it stood for. <laughs> so I'm just going to use Ghidorah, the, the three-headed monster, for this review. This is the fifth film in the Godzilla franchise. Of course, this is going to be the seventh video of a Godzilla review because I also added Mothra's standalone movie as part of Godzilla's reviews and I think I'm gonna do the same thing for Rodan later on but anyway this is also the first time in film history where they decided to turn Godzilla from a villain into a good guy basically so that was very interesting another very interesting thing about this movie is that they kinda talk yeah that's weird but it's kind of awesome because I remembered that I'm like oh yeah they did it's fucking funny <laughs> anyway aliens come down to the planet earth okay and threaten to destroy Tokyo just like they did in other Godzilla movies you know and they got this big monster that they're gonna use you know and uh, Mothra you know the earth's guardian um, tries to recruit Rodan and Godzilla to help fight um, Ghidorah, or King Ghidorah, I'm gonna call him Ghidorah because that was his original name, Ghidorah, and they both laugh at her, basically. So she goes off to fight Ra Ghidorah by herself, gets her ass kicked, Godzilla and Rodan are like, okay, let's help her out. And we get this big awesome fucking battle. This is a cheesy but great in entry into the Godzilla franchise, okay? Hell, this movie is even quoted as the best, uh, Sh Shawa, Shawa series Godzilla movie. I would have to agree. This movie is fucking awesome. <laughs> it it is great, man. It is. Oh my god, the Godzilla suit in this movie is interesting to look at. It's pretty decent. It's not cheap or nothing. Well, it is kind of cheap. It's good. it's it's Japanese for fuck's sake <laughs> but you know it's it's different and I like it you know I'm not sure how many films the suit will go on to be in but I'm pretty sure I recognize it in a few more movies since then and you know you get your little typical aliens coming to earth and all that stuff just like we had and I think was it I don't think it was was it Terror of Mega Godzilla I'm not really sure it was one of those other later movies that I'm, we'll be getting to. We're going to be getting back into Godzilla now. Anyway, I can't say how the acting was in this movie. I guess you could say it's okay. They're all Japanese. It's in Japanese for fuck's sake. So I can't really say if it's good or not. But it, was, it is a very entertaining movie. And I highly suggest you all watch it. I mean, Godzilla fans, why the fuck not? You know what I mean? And with that in mind, I'm going to give Ghidorah three-headed monster. I was going to say dragon. <laughs> he is a dragon, but still. Uh, a. Great movie. Loved it. Drop your comments down below. Let me know what you guys think about Ghidorah down below. Did you like it? Did you hate it? Let me know if you don't. If you want me to review Rodan as well, since Rodan was in the fucking movie. I thought about doing it, but I was like, I don't know. I might, but I want to hear your input. So let me know.